<laughs> I made a video last year about this uh, cool and very exciting device that we use for cocktails, the flavor blaster. It came in this uh, nice looking box. What's in the box? One flavor blaster, there are five different colors available, one uh, USB cable, well, I used it last time, like three months ago. <laughs> One coil and a tank. And in this cool little box, different aromatic flavors for all kinds of cocktails. And also on their website available, this specially formulated non-toxic bubble mixture that creates edible bubbles. It couldn't be simpler to use it, so take tank, open it, and let's add smoke flavor. That's the one I've been using mostly. Now close it tight. Put it inside, close it, press OK, and it's ready to go. <laughs> so this makes it the easiest way to infuse cocktail with a smoke flavor. You can also do this presentation. The bubble mixture, deep flavor blaster in it, and now you can make bubbles like this one. You can just uh, place it on top of the drink, or what you can do, you can just drop it on top of it. Oh, wait a second, like that. <laughs> you serve it this way, bring it in front of someone and then just do this extra presentation. In my opinion, this is probably the greatest device when it comes to a cocktail presentation, add a different aroma, and wow, someone you're making a cocktail for. It's really easy to set up and use. It's been widely used in cocktail bars since it's very practical. I recently watched a video that now Flavor Blaster being used in the Disneyland, but probably not for this type of cocktail. <laughs> oh yeah, and he's been using it too. Well, everything is great about this uh, little device, right? Except one little thing. It's still pretty expensive. And recently, ad popped up on my Instagram with this cocktail smoker kit. And clearly showed that you can make bubbles very similar to Flavor Blaster. So I decided to order it right away. It was a little bit confusing. Option random color for $33 and three pieces for $59. Well, I figured that it included bubbles, so I decided to get that one. And it was totally okay that it says it will take a month to arrive here in Las Vegas. But I wasn't okay with how it arrived. Bubbles bottle wasn't close tight and it spilled all over the package. Here's what included in the box. Two, the same size rubber tubes, a little metal funnel, bubbles with proper Chinese description and a picture of a different smoking gun. When I opened the box, there was a metal connector that plugs into this vacuum, small piece with filter to load wooden chips and electronic vacuum itself. This device already had batteries and to make it work, you need to push and hold the button. As soon as you release it, it stopped blowing air. When I opened it, I realized that it's the simplest and very cheap looking device. It built like a cheap plastic fan that you can get for a few dollars on the Wish website. And this little funnel with filter is glass, which is a little concerning since we need to light it up with a torch. Okay, this funnel should be connected to the tube. For a test, I put a small amount of wooden chips, light it up, and as long as you hold the bottom, it works okay. Attach tube, and now seems like you can use it for your smoky cocktails. As expected, the glass piece got really hot and easily can break. Now I want to try to make bubbles since that is exactly what I purchased it for. After a few attempts, I figured out how to make a bubble, but then the nightmare started. I added different wooden chips that are not so fine, but we use them all the time with a smoking gun and it stopped working. So you can't use smoker flavored chips here, but that's not it. I switched back to fine chips and when I tried to make smoky bubbles, it was extremely uncomfortable to use it since it stops working as soon as you release your finger from the bottom. And to make smoke going, you need to keep burning chips. So I felt like you need a third hand to operate it. I had to check online reviews and see if anybody else have similar problems. <laughs> well, reviews didn't help much. But then I started searching more online and instead of advertised cocktail smoking kit, I put, just like it says in the box, electronic vacuum pipe. And what I realized that it's being sold on AliExpress and Wish as a smoking hookah for as low as like $11. And that explains now why the filter is so fine here, just because it's supposed to be used for tobacco and not for the wooden chips. Now we know why we also need to keep holding the bottom to make it work. Don't need torch anymore, so just a regular lighter, right? There you go. 
<laughs> At this point, I even surprised how it had two or three stars on Amazon instead of just one. It can't be even compared with the Flavor Blaster. It feels pretty cheap. You need only a special fine wooden chips to make it work. As I showed to you earlier, it's pretty complicated to operate because of this bottom. And of course, forget to use it at the bar. If you will be looking for a smoking gun, just uh, get this one that works really well with wooden chips and made with a purpose to infuse with smoke food and drinks not to smoke tobacco. <laughs> I'm going to leave a link in the description to both Flavor Blaster and Smoking Gun, but uh, I would recommend not to waste your money and avoid this device. If you guys enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and I know you will love this video where I reviewed a multifunctional tool that claims to be the Swiss Army knife for bartenders. Thank you guys and I'll see you in the next video.